Mrs. Kirk here, and today we are going to draw a taco. Here we go, time to draw our taco. I'm using a dry erase marker on a whiteboard today, but of course you can draw on a piece of paper so that you can color a little bit later on. So we're gonna start off with a line that has a bit of a curve on the bottom. Comes up a touch like that. This is the bottom of our taco. Now in just a little bit, we're gonna start here and connect from there over to this curved line. This will be the part of the taco closest to us. Oh, it's a little wobbly, but that's okay. I like when my artwork looks special and looks like my own, so I don't worry too much about that. Now this line over here, we're gonna bring it up and curve it over and in to connect with that first line. This is the back part of the taco. All right, let's start filling our taco. First, we need some meat. What kind of meat do you like in your taco? Doing some ground beef with taco seasoning in it right there. And then I like tomatoes. I'm gonna add in just a couple of rainbow lines. I'll color those red later on and it will look like a tomato. Time for some lettuce. Had some wavy lines, interesting wavy lines. We call these curvilinear lines, also known as organic lines. Hopefully the word organic kind of makes you think of vegetables because wavy organic lines come from nature. And then obviously we need some cheese, lots of cheese. Takes a minute to add in cheese, cheese everywhere. Where do you like cheese? On everything if you ask me i like cheese everywhere so a lot of cheese i'm then going to make my taco friendly so an eye there we go leave a little area white on the eye kind of makes it look shiny it's sort of fun and another eye this drawing was taken from artforkidshub.com. I love how they draw. I love the videos they do. I think they make it super easy to create really great artwork. And I really appreciate what they do. So be sure to check out artforkidshub.com to find lots of great videos. All right, color in the mustache. Hopefully, you were able to draw yours on paper, or give it a try again and draw that one on paper, and then you can color it. Awesome! Great job, guys. How fun. Happy Cinco de Mayo.